Hey everyone, Joe Gray here. Today I'm going to be doing a review on the Scorpion EX from Cam Caddy. Alright, so the first thing I want to go over is one of the main differences between the Scorpion EX and the original Scorpion. So the biggest difference is right here. You can see that all four feet have threads in them, and what this is for is a cheese plate. The cheese plate is an accessory cam caddy sells on their website, and what it does is it allows you to take your whole cam caddy setup and mount it on a tripod or even the shoulder stabilizer that they sell on their website. This is great because the cam caddy allows you to mount tons of accessories in countless different ways, so now you can take that whole setup and put it on a tripod for a talking video or if you just want a steady shot and don't need to move around much. Alright, so now a review. The first thing I would like to mention is these little hook looking things around here. There are three in total and these sort of act like an insurance for your gear. You can get some kind of string or rope and lace it through here and then onto your gear. This is a good little accessory so in case of product failure, which most likely won't happen, your gear will still be safe. You can see on the website that there are tons of accessories that go with the Scorpion EX and the original Scorpion, but you only need certain accessories in certain scenarios. I recommend getting the Scorpion EX starter kit because this will include the Scorpion EX and three of the main accessories you will need. The first of which is a shoe mount. This goes on the top portion of your Scorpion and has this little knob for locking it into place. This is designed to hold one accessory but with other attachments such as the Ford's flashener you can mount a lot more. This is also designed to act as a stabilizer for heavier setups. If you turn it upside down and use a D flashener you can connect it to the accessory shoe on the top of most Canon cameras and the handle won't move around anymore. Another accessory that will come with your starter kit is a 1420 flashner. This gives you the ability to mount something threaded on top such as a camera and then mount that on the flashner or accessory wing which is also included in the kit. And finally the accessory wing which is meant to hold multiple accessories. This can be mounted behind the camera using an extra mounting knob and many accessories can slide right onto there. The Scorpion itself is very well made with features like a rubbery bottom side of the handle for good grip and a rubbery surface so your gear won't move around. If you are anywhere from a beginner to an expert filmmaker then the Cam Caddy is a must have. Another common use for it is filming skateboarding. It not only acts as a stabilizer but also allows for tons of accessories and gives you the ability to easily get hard to get angles. There are cheaper versions of the Scorpion such as the Opteca X-Grip, but there are many flaws to these and don't allow nearly as many mounting options as the Scorpion EX. Overall, it is an awesome product and is very well made. There is no doubt you will fall in love with it immediately. For more information and to view the whole selection of products, please visit www.camcaddy.com.